Hey, what's up guys? It is uh, Thursday, and I'm just picking the camera up for the first time, which actually the second time, but the first time that I'm actually going to use the footage. Anyway, let me roll the window up because I got some dude who's on the cell phone outside. I don't really care what he's talking about. <laughs> I had a topic come in from Bertovsky. Actually, the, the topic is Dutch ovens. Now, at first I wasn't sure whether he was talking about when you cook like a big stew or whatever, you put everything in a big pot, and that's called a Dutch oven. Or if he was talking about when you're in bed with your significant other and you fart and pull the covers over their head. So I did ask him, and he did in fact say that he was talking about farting and pulling the covers over your significant other's head. Now, I've got to be honest, I've tried to get Bobby with this a few times, and, and that's just, you know, that's just the way I am. But she knows that that's just the way that I am, and she always seems to catch me when I try. So, I haven't been able to get her with it. And I think that the main reason is just goofing off. I, I don't think there's any, well, I don't know, maybe there is malice in, in some of your attempts at, uh, giving someone a Dutch oven, but uh, I know in mine it's just goofing off and I'm not, I'm not trying to hurt anybody because I, <laughs> I don't think that uh, I can fart enough methane gas out to, to actually hurt anyone. So the question of the day. Is why are high school teachers such retards? Oh, I don't know. Oh. No, the question of the day is, why do people try to give other people Dutch ovens? I don't know, why don't you tell us, because you're the pro at that. No, I've already, I've already tried. You've already tried to give a Dutch oven? No, or explain no. it? I've tried several times, and you catch me every time. But the, you've got to answer the question. Why do you think people try to give other people the Dutch oven? Is there malice involved in it? Like, are I they, think so, especially or, if it's coming from you after a hot sauce wing night. Yeah, well, I haven't tried to do that. I'm, Great. I've been afraid to fart for the last like, 12, 13 hours. So, Taylor, do you know what a Dutch oven is? Yeah. What is it? No, that's a cup of fart. <laughs> oh, no, that's when you fart in blankets and you put them in blankets, right? Yeah. Yeah. See, I was right. So Why do people do that? Do they do it because they hate the person or just because they're goofing off? A little bit of both. It could I go think. either way. If you would have done that to me last night, I would have had to say it was because you hated me. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I would have even done that to the dog last night. We got the question of the day today. What? Do you think there's it's malice or goofing off when someone does uh, the Dutch oven? The fuck's a Dutch oven? So when you <laughs> fart in bed and pull the covers over your other's your uh, partner's head. Now is it what? Malice or just goofing off? I think it's just goofing off. Just goofing off, unless you really hate the fucking person. <laughs> yeah, but you shouldn't be in bed with them if you hate them. There you go. <laughs> Good answer. So there you have it, guys. That's why people give other people a Dutch oven. That's right. Because they're just goofing off. It has nothing to do with malice or hatred or anything like that. Because if you hate someone, they shouldn't be in your bed. And why is that the truth? Because your dad said so. Because my dad said so. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Take care. Wait, that's not all he said. What else did I say? Not you, your dad. Oh. That it's better not to know them if you're in their bed. Oh, right. <laughs> I'm not even going to touch that. <laughs> okay, see you tomorrow, Probably guys. Probably a good thing. You never know what you'll catch. See you tomorrow, guys. Bye! Take care!